All right, everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the Amazon Soldier channel. My name is Curtis Keeping, and in this video, I'm going to talk to you about drop shipping, what it is, and what will happen to your Amazon account if you do it on Amazon. So a lot of people ask me, Curtis, do you do drop shipping on your Amazon account? Is that how you make your sales? The answer is no, I definitely do not do drop shipping with my Amazon account. In fact, drop shipping is against Amazon's terms and conditions. And if they find out that you're drop shipping through your Amazon store, they will shut your account down without any questions whatsoever, okay? Amazon highly, highly frowns upon people who use their Amazon account to drop ship. Why is this? Well, in the past, uh, a lot of people were setting up Amazon accounts they were listing you know, hundreds and thousands of products that they could get from Walmart, that they get from Target, Home Depot, and all the other miscellaneous uh, big retail stores. So they would go list all the products they could find. They would list it for higher than what was available at Walmart or what was available at Amazon. And then once the customer placed an order through their Amazon store, then the store owners would scramble and go over to Walmart or Target or Home Depot, wherever the products were available, and they would put in the customer's information. You know, they put in the shipping address, the customer's name, all that good stuff, and then they would order the product from the Walmart or the Target and get it shipped directly to the customer. So what was happening was uh, the products were showing up at the customer's house, you know, in the Walmart or in the Target box or in the Home Depot box. And the customers were like curious, oh, wow, I thought I ordered this product from Amazon. Why is it showing up in a Target box? So then they would go, they would look on Target.com or they would look on Walmart.com and they would see that the product was listed for much, much cheaper than what they had paid on Amazon. The reason why the price was that much higher on Amazon was because the drop shipper or the store owner had to raise their price by that much to factor in their profit. A lot of customers were finding out that they were getting overcharged and then they would go and file complaints to Amazon and they would file complaints against the Amazon store owners, right? So this all started to escalate very quickly. Uh, the word was spreading across the US that there was money to be made drop shipping on Amazon. So these drop shipping stores were popping up literally overnight and people were literally going in and listing, you know, hundreds of the same product that everybody else was doing. And it just really, really got out of control to a point where Amazon changed their terms of service and basically said that it's it's illegal. You're not allowed to do it on our platform. And if you're caught doing it, we will shut down and suspend your account indefinitely. OK, so again, that's why I do not drop ship on Amazon. It's not worth it. And to be honest, there's way, way more margin doing wholesale, okay? There's way more margin in doing what we're doing. There's way more profit and there's a lot less risk, okay? Amazon loves people who are practicing the wholesale method uh, on their platforms because we're getting our products from legitimate suppliers. Uh, our products are in great condition because they come right from the manufacturer things like that. They're in the original packaging, they're in the original boxes, all that good stuff. We get our product shipped from our supplier directly to Amazon's warehouse. Amazon inspects all the inventory. Uh, everything's easy peasy. At the end of the day, you have nothing to worry about, right? So again, that's why I don't drop ship. I do wholesale. So quickly, I'll fill you in on what actually happens when uh, a drop ship order is placed okay so you have your customer right here they place an order with your amazon store let's say they're buying a cell phone case okay so they see a cell phone case listed in your amazon store they think that you know curtis has the cell phone case in his store uh, so they place the order little do they know that curtis doesn't actually have any cell phone cases at all and he was just listing something that he's seen on walmart he tacked on, uh, you know, $9 for his profit and his shipping. And he just raised his price, you know, from $20 to $29, right? So the customer thinks, hey, it's a good deal. I like that phone case, places the order. So then Curtis scrambles, takes the customer's information, 
uh, takes this guy's information right here, puts it in on the walmart.com or the target.com and basically directs that cell phone case to be then shipped to the customer. The customer receives the package, you know, four or five days later, it's in a Walmart box or a Target box. And they're like, hey, why is this in a Walmart box? This is weird. So they go and they type in, you know, cell phone case for the iPhone, black cell phone case or whatever. And they pull up the product that they ordered from, they thought they ordered from your Amazon store. In fact, it's listed on walmart.com for, you know, $9 cheaper. All of a sudden customer is pissed off. They file a complaint against you and they complain to Amazon. All of a sudden, Amazon has a dissatisfied customer. Who do you think is going to win? You or the dissatisfied customer? Well, I can tell you right away that Amazon isn't going to ask any questions. He's probably going, Amazon is probably going to refund the customer's money and they're probably going to kick you off of Amazon and remove your selling privileges, okay? So again, guys, that's how drop shipping works. I just thought I'd put that video out there to kind of clear the air uh, and about what we do and educate you on what drop shipping is and hopefully um, inf make you or hopefully allow you to make an informed decision on whether or not you want to do drop shipping or whether you want to practice a proven business model like wholesale. That's much more safer. And quite frankly, the profit margins are a lot higher with wholesale than it is with drop shipping. Okay. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That just lets us know that we're doing a good job. Uh, subscribe to the channel and make sure to keep checking out our free content on the AMZ Soldier channel. See you guys in the next video.